What's up, everybody? Okay, so today is a pretty damn good one. Ever wanted to use your dad's clothes for metahumans? Now, the dad's library is massive. So it would be nice to use the clothes, right? Anyway, here's a nice way of using Meta Tailor. Uh, I'm just going to load up like the space jumper here in Daz. I'm going to export it. You can just say file export. And I'm just going to save it out to something on my desktop. Daz to I've got the suit already right there. Okay, save it out. Boom. Uh, and just, you know, you can use uh, just the... The whatevers, the whatevers, mate. You know, all right. Just here's the settings. It's just the whatevers, mate. Okay. Um, and then say accept, and you're good to go. Okay. And then we're going to open up Meta Taylor. Uh, first of all, you got to export the uh, character, your Meta Human out. If you haven't, I'm not going to do that again. If you <laughs> if you haven't seen that, just go to the the video before this one. I'll try and leave a link. Okay. So right here, that's the video you want. Meta Taylor for UE5, MetaHumans, new look at whatever. That's the one you want. That should, that'll show you how to get the, uh, the MetaHumans inside of, uh, out of Unsight. Out. How to export the MetaHuman, okay? All right, my loves, once you're in here, you're going to say create new project, and you're going to call it, uh, say, Daz to MetaHuman, or whatever you want to call it, mate. Now, importing your avatar, Abadar. Once again, look at that video before, the one that I said, I'll try and put a links up, all right, mate? But that, that one goes through all of that. Don't want to do it again. Don't want to do it again. Once you've got your, your uh, metahuman inside, then you'll have its avatar, okay? And it's very easy. It's very easy. You literally just say here, you can't see that, can you, mates? You can't see that. It's, there we go. There we go, mate. So literally what you're just going to do is you're going to say import avatar and then you'll follow the thingies. But uh, I've got a video on that. Just, just check, it, check it out, mate. Um, once you've got your avatar, what you want to do is you want to import the clothes, right? So you're going to say clothes, accessory. You're going to go where you put your suit, mate. All right, my love. All right, my darling. All right, my love. There, suit FPX. I'm going to bring it in. And that's what you get, love. That's what you get, love. Right. So you can call it what you want. You can bring in the textures and whatever you want from that. I'm not going to do that now. By the way, if you want to get the textures of that suit into Unreal, which we'll do, you can just go straight up here, mate, love. Go to uh, click on your suit. Click to surfaces down here. Click on this bloody suit, love. And over here in the base color, you can just click it, say browse. It'll take you exactly where it is. And then you can just copy the URL and you can close that again. And you can open up one of these thingamabobbies. Uh, <clears throat> a file explorer, a flare explorer, and just put in this little URL there. And you get all the textures for the, the beautiful suits. Huh? This you can just drag and drop inside of Unreal Engine. We'll do that in a little while. All right. So we've got that. Uh, now we can say next step, right? We've got that, and it's not fitting, mate. It's not fitting. What's going on? Right, first we've got to say it's a full body, right? A full body, so it sets a nice template full rip, mate. And that's all we got to do here. Okay? Still not fitting nicely, but we'll say next step. And then what, that, what it does, love, what it does, Ari. Ari, are you listening, Ari? Just got to take a swig of coffee. All right, next step. All right, for the tenth time, love. Next step, do something, you bastard. All right, so then we get to this very slowly. I, something looks broken here. I, what's going on? What's going on, love? What is it? What is it? Why? Why aren't you working, you stupid bastard? Let me have a look into this and see. All right, let's try that again, right? So you say import, you're gonna say cloth accessory. I'm gonna say the suit. It should bring in the suit. All good, mate, it's all good. Once again, all the textures, all this kind of stuff. Next step, it's an overall great next step. And now before we say start pose match, we're gonna say move and we're gonna just move this into its place, okay? So some, something like, just try and move it better so it encompasses. It doesn't have to cover perfectly. Don't have to do that, love. But 
There we go. That looks a bit better, right? You can rotate, scale, do whatever you want, but that looks pretty darn good. I'm going to say confirm, and I'm going to say start pose match at the top there. Now with here, now I can start just dragging these things into the right places. You just got to drag it the best you can. It doesn't have to, once again, it can overlap slightly and do things but you're just trying to get into a nice place. The nice thing is if I'm doing this this side, it's doing the other side already for us. Um, and then you can just drag these pointers and stuff wherever they need to be going, mate. All right. So these can go in a little bit like that. This can go in definitely something like that, something like that. That is looking good. Right, so you just drag it. If there's slight overlap and you can't get it right, it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. There can be like little errors and stuff. Anyway, once you're done with that, you can confirm that and you can say next step. Boom. What this will do, love, is it will start just mending it nicely to the body. Okay, and that's it. That's it, really. Boom. It's raw. Right, uh, it's connected, love. It's connected. Right, so once you've got that now, uh, you can pretty much, it's done. The next thing you've got to say is export, and you can call it suit, uh, meta human space suit, okay. Uh, FBX is fine. Texture format, scale, one-to-one, -one. just leave all of this on, or leave it all on. Choose a location, love. Put it in, uh, you know, wherever you want to put it in. I'm going to put it to Daz and MetaHuman. And uh, I'm going to just say, okay. And I'm going to export. And that's it. You've got your suit. It's exported. Now we can open up Unreal Engine. Okay, so now that we're in Unreal Engine, uh, take that same MetaHuman that you used for uh, What's This Face for MetaTailor. And what we're going to do is, first of all, we want to know what. Uh, what skeleton they're using okay so you'll click on the the uh, in outliner edit the bp of it you'll come over here me love and you can go check out what uh where 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 are you where where is it where is it mm. body where's all the other bloody where's all the other bloody options right let's just click on that body Call it double click. Oh, you'll just be under here, and you can see metahuman base skeleton. Okay, metahuman base skeleton. That's what it's using. That one. So all we got to do now is we got to drag and drop uh, the suit uh, into. Well, let me just do this better for you. There we go. So we're just gonna drag the suit now into uh, our, our browser or whatever and over here first thing you're going to do is skeleton and then just go look for that uh, metahuman base skeleton okay i think that's the one that we said right metahuman base skeleton it sure is it sure is so metahuman base skeleton and we should be good to go uh import animations we don't need to do anything else there we can just say import okay and that's it once you've done that, love, you'll see all of this stuff inside of here, all right? So how do we change over the bloody skeleton, mate? You just click on your meta human, go to its body. Not the body, actually. Where? Yeah, body. And you can just drag these clothes straight into here. Boom. That's it. And your meta human is now wearing your dad's clothes, love. Look at that. That's, that's lovely. That's lovely. Yeah. That's great. Let's set up a quick sequence. Let's just make a new sequence. Right click and say, uh, where is it? Cinematics level sequence. Uh, call it Bob. Always name your work so you know exactly what's going on. I'm going to take that in here. I'm going to take in a camera. Uh, actually, I'm just going to open up the sequence. And I'll click on the metahuman and throw it inside of the metahuman. Boom. And now we can have a look. We can have a look at it, mate. Beautiful. 
Now, you'll notice that the control board, the body's not there because we changed out the body, okay? But we do have the, the face to lift. If you don't have the body, it's not a big deal. Just click the plus button on, on the name of your metahuman. And, and we want the body. But isn't there an easier way? Yeah, no, okay, just click on the body. And then on body here, you can click the plus and you can say control rig, uh, asset based control rig, metahuman control rig. Okay. Bam. And that will set up your, your control rig, me love. Okay. So now, as you can clearly see, you can click on, on these kind of things and you can get you can get everything move hold on there love hold on there love come a little bit closer i don't know why the eyes disappear with the materials and stuff i don't know but you can start doing cool things like this <laughs> oh hell yeah you know when you're just at a rave and it's just about to break and you're like kind of and then when it breaks <laughs> oh man, that's amazing! I got a hair, mate. I, I destroyed the meta human. You know, you're in a rave. No, oh, yeah, that doesn't work, love. Oh, hold on. And you know, you're just jamming, and then all of a sudden the music breaks. <laughs> anyway, okay, and that's it. Uh, now you have everything working. Mm. You have Daz clothes inside of Unreal Engine, which is wicked. Probably got to do the IKs. Uh, which is absolutely insane. Just tap, just tap IK in your sequencer, and you can you can put on the uh, arm IKs. There we go, loves. And then, you know, you've got Daz clothes. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. There, there might be some little paint things and whatever, but you know this you can always fix up in Meditator. But otherwise, you've got a working. You've got your clothes inside of uh, MetaHuman, which is just insane. It's insane. Um, it's just insane. Wow. Anyway, guys, I hope this helps. Uh, I mean, it just opens up the world, right? You, Daz's library is so massive. And now that we've got uh, the clothes, that you can use the clothes in your metahumans, it's ridiculous. Anyway, I hope this helps. Have a great weekend, y'all. I won't be here next weekend. It's Easter, okay? The bunny's coming. Bunny said, no working, mate. All right? Eat some eggs. Get a little plumper, okay? Uh, so there's nothing next weekend. <laughs> Have a great weekend, guys, and see you later. Bye.